The Northern Gateway project is not just about pipelines. If approved, it will result in 220 super tankers, each carrying up to 2 million barrels of diluted bitumen traveling through northern BC's coastal waters every year for the next 50 years. That's 11,000 trips each way. The National Energy Board's Joint Review Panel has already approved this project, claiming that the benefits outweigh the risks. But do they understand the risks of a major tanker spill on our coast? Do they understand the costs? We don't think they do. We are a small group of independent professional engineers and engineering professors with more than 100 years of experience with projects like Arctic drilling structures, offshore supply vessels, double hull tanker barges, oil spill cleanup equipment, tugboats, and coal terminals. We've spent the past two years analyzing this project and we think the risks of a major tanker spill are much higher than what is being claimed. We participated in the hearings along with many other groups. We submitted a letter of comment with our concerns to the panel. We've read the Joint Review Panel's report. We haven't seen anything meaningful that addresses our concerns. Northern Gateway talks about how they will have their work cut out for them because of the Joint Review Panel's 209 tough conditions. We think they're just getting started. To learn more about Northern Gateway, how it will affect your life, and most importantly, how to take action, visit ConcernedEngineers.org.